Well, I've been watching your uh, webisodes yes. on Dose.ca. Yes. Uh, where did you come up with the idea? I guess that was your idea to, to do a web yeah, series? Yeah, it's just a day in the life type thing, you know. It helps to get, you know, to put a face to the, the music mm -hmm. and stuff and give people a bit of an inside scoop of what's going on. In and that life. totally works. All that stuff when you, you look at MySpace and now the webisodes, people love the reality thing. I right now, so, like yeah. we love you as an artist. People listen to your music; they want to know about you. Yeah, it's you know a what toppings you now. put on your pizza. Absolutely. That's what they care about yeah. nowadays. It's 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 much different than it ever was. I think in the '70s or '80s or even into the '90s, you know, there was more of a, a mystery to the artist. You didn't mm -hmm. really want to know that Ozzy Osbourne drank orange juice and milk, or you know what yeah, I mean. Right. It was just the, you didn't want to know that they. You wanted them to have a bit of a superhero quality to them. And yeah. these days, I think it's just the complete opposite. And who is on your iPod right now? I love Blue October. I think they're they're one of my. Uh, when I was in LA working with Jeff Blue last summer, I bought the album, and I was expecting you know not to like it at all. I heard that the single "Hate Me," and uh, went out and bought the album just because I thought the single was really honest and just fell in love with that album. And I've been listening to it nonstop for years. Really? So that album I love. There's a band from the UK called Nizlopi. Mm -hmm. um, I'm love everything they do. So those young people that are out there who you know are starting a, a solo career and are looking up to you or maybe starting their own band, what advice do you have for them in entering the, Cadi uh, the Canadian industry? Um, practice, practice, practice. That's all it's about. Do you I believe in luck or being at the right place at the right absolutely. time? Absolutely. I think there's a whole lot of luck involved, you know, because there's so many great acts out there that never, ever you know, we'll never get a chance, you know, mm -hmm. so oh, I think I think it's, you know, really, really practicing, like I said, focusing in on one thing. Mm -hmm. To me, I think songwriting is the most important thing, so learn how to write a great song. Mm -hmm. And then just getting your business together, because that's the biggest thing. I know so many great artists in this city that just have no idea how to get heard by a major yeah. label, you know what I mean? Which, or, like, in, other than your web series and, and um, uh, MySpace, how, how do you get heard? How do you get your name out there? Um, you know, for me, it was just finding email addresses and sending really? stuff out. Okay. Yeah, and uh, yeah, just being just persistent. Yeah, yeah, fine. Like I, I ran into Jeff Blue like that. I got my brother to just call his office and mm -hmm. you know set up a phone meeting, and we got our music to him and stuff like that. And I ended up getting my record deal the same way, just emailing an A and R Universal. And yeah. so, if you could perform your favorite song on on your album with any singer or songwriter in the world, who would you love to share the the stage with? Oh, Bill Withers or Bruce Springsteen, I think. Bruce Springsteen, yeah, yeah, yeah. I cool. love Bruce Springsteen. And just to hear them singing your song, yeah, I think be that great. would just be awesome. Sure. Absolutely. And you dance. No, I. A little bit of a white boy moves. Come on, let's get real. I saw in the web series. I like that fun. You like the, you like to dance? Are you the first one in a club to kind of get up? No, and jam no, the music? no, no. Usually it takes a couple of drinks before I'll get up. Really? So you won't add any dance moves, any choreography to any no, of your shows? There's not going to be any of that. Really? No. Okay, so we can't look forward to that tonight. I don't think so. Okay. You might see awesome. something. First thing that comes to your mind, I'll give you two options. You just answer as fast as you can, okay? okay. Boxers or briefs? Boxers. Boxers. But not the baggy ones, the boxer, boxer briefs. briefs. Yeah. In the middle, okay. Yeah. Um, peanut butter or jam? Peanut butter. Beer or wine? Beer. Oh, that was a fast one, not Absolutely. even the wine at all. Absolutely. Video games or a movie? Probably a movie, movie? but I don't really like either. No, really? I don't watch movies don't a lot movies. at all, no. Okay. no. Um, singing or playing the guitar? Probably singing. Rock or reggae? Rock. Right, that was easy. Bob Marley or Elvis Presley? Can't even really go there, can That's a hard you? one, yeah. 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 I can't. I you can't, you can't? No. Not even like it's split right down the middle, 50-50? Music is so mood variant. Okay, blondes or brunettes? And hey, brunettes. Oh, are you doing that just because no, I'm here? Okay. No, absolutely. Okay. Give or receive. Wow. And that, uh, that doesn't have to be okay. sexual. That can mean anything. Receive. Receive. <laughs> Finally, an honest man. People always say give too because they know that's what you're asking for. So I wish you best of luck tonight. So I will be in first. I'll be in front row, believe me, waiting for yesterday, man. Um, and good luck when your album hits awesome, in, in September. I know you're going to do well. You're a spectacular singer. Just just so. keep going at Thanks it, man. So and I'll be watching your web series. So nice meeting you. You too. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thanks. Do I have black all over my face?